Phones burnt make it quick. Uh, I'm like your one friend, Aiden. You should be nicer to me. Great. I'm hanging up now. It's a job, jackass. Fix your gig. I can't take it. Travel restrictions. <sighs> I told you I'm not doing that hired gun work anymore. Oh, come on. It's corporate espionage. Scumbags screwing scumbags. No bystanders. Huge payday. Mm hmm What's the catch? It's in London, which is not the easiest place to get to these days. London. It's where Jackson lives. Yeah. Why do you think I called you, asshole? Okay, I gotta go. To help you blend in. <laughs> Everyone here must wear one now. <laughs> uh, your car fell through. The London bombings, uh, they change everything. Many things are hard to get now. Car won't be a problem. Oui. Good, but it is also your flat. You have somewhere else you can go, family? It's complicated. <laughs> Uh, it is okay. Still family, no? You will see. Yeah. I will see. in custody. My people dug this out of your chest. If it was one inch in any other direction, we wouldn't be talking. I read the files you downloaded from Brokatech. The ones about me. They're all technically true, yeah, but... I feel like they didn't quite give you the full story. 
This is the Mark I. Simple AI, good for simple things. Uh, the Mark II will be controlled by the thoughts of a human pilot. Military, police, it'll all be transformed overnight. But one day, these will permanently hold the human mind. No more death. No more limitations. We'll be able to live on Mars like it was Maui. And for all this, all I need is that little device stolen by your partner. The one in the stupid mask? I don't know that guy. <laughs> Silence was a better strategy than lying there, Mr. Pierce. Are you done? Look, I don't know that guy. But I can find him. I'm good at that. You just have to let me go. I just don't think I can trust you without some kind of... insurance. Perhaps your nephew, Jackson? Hmm? He lives in London, doesn't he? I offered you a good deal. Take it. <laughs> yeah, look, I, I want to believe you. I really do. <laughs> but I just can't. Not yet. No. I'll return once my little helper here has made you a bit more trustworthy. is wrong with you? I have not seen you in what? 15 years? And then you want to break into my place? This is not what I'm doing, Jax. I'm sorry. But you're in danger. No. Not this time. I mean, you gotta send a an email or, or, or a text. Something. That is how you do this. Jax, I can't. I'm sorry, but I... You've been out for 12 hours, Aiden. I don't think they're coming. Jax, you have to trust me. There are people looking for you. They are serious. I'll be fine. Trust me, after everything with, uh... You? Well, I made sure we knew how to handle ourselves. <laughs> okay. Hey, can you leave a channel open at least? Anything happens, I'll be here in three minutes. Yeah. Yeah, fine. I'll leave a channel open. But you gotta go. That box is for you. I brought it over the last time, and, uh... I don't know why. But it's your shit. Jax.
Okay. I've had a minute to think. And I'm gonna help you. No, Jackson. I can't let you get involved. I didn't ask for you to come. And all my life's on hold until you're gone, so why don't you just bring me up to speed? You're right. So, there's this rich scumbag called Thomas Rampart. He needs something called the Broker Bridge, or he's gonna go to jail for a scam he's running on the government. Rampart. Robotics guy, right? Does private security? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> and let me guess. He hired you to grab this broker thing, and then he turned out to be an asshole. Pretty close. The broker bridge was stolen by this old dead set clown. Goes by Wrench. And Rampart probably thought you two were working together. And then he threatened me if you didn't turn over this Wrench guy over to him? Exactly. And frankly, I'd love to. But I have no idea where he is. So that's why you were looking into bomb supplies. You know, I do know my way around London pretty well at this point. I might be able to turn up a lead or two. All right. Just don't put yourself in any danger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jackson? I'll be fine. Remember? <laughs> Hey, 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 come on, come on. We're on the same side here. Broker Bridge. Now. There. Really? Asshole. Okay, hang on. Hang on! Just... No mask, no wrench, just Reggie. Look, you can't give that thing to Rampart. Whatever deal you have with him, he's gonna try to fuck you over. <laughs> Believe me, I would know. He's not stupid, he knows who I am. He knew who I was too, that's why he was interested in my company. He said he read about my rumored dead set connections in a Wired article. You designed the robots. Yeah. I know robots, but he knew business. He had this whole speech about space flight and human evolution and... and... I completely fucking fell for it. Yeah, I heard part of the story. So what? Now you want revenge? No. Well, yes. But mostly I'm just tired of fucking criminals and con men running the world. I don't know what I want, exactly. I just know he can't win. Sorry, Reggie, I have no choice. <clears throat> For what it's worth, I spent my life fighting people like Rembrandt. Doesn't work. So what? We're all supposed to just give up? No, you shouldn't. Some fights are worth losing. Mr. Pierce, do you have it? We're going. No, no, no. Not before I confirm it works. It's okay, get, get up. up. Hello, Thomas. What? I've already said everything I need to say to you, so this is actually a message for Aiden. So there, buddy? What the hell is this? Hold on. Don't worry, it's a quick one. Stop! <laughs> Go! Stop them! Go!
There! There! Engage fire! Kill them! Yeah, just barely. Do you have like a like a needle or something? Uh, uh, yeah. How's this? What are you doing? If he was just unconscious, he would still react to pain and sound. But he's not. What do you mean? He's like in a coma or something? Oh shit! How do you fix a coma? By taking him to a hospital. Where we'd be a rampart bait? Not an option. I know. Fuck! Okay. First thing, we need to stabilize him. He's lost a lot of blood. So I'm gonna need some bandages, iodine, and IV Whoa, 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 slow your roll there, Florence Nightingale. I'm gonna go get geared up, and then you can give me your shopping list. And where are you planning on getting that stuff? I don't know, maybe I'll hijack an ambulance or something. Look, you stay here, you look after Abe, okay? And don't worry, Uncle Rich has got this under control. This. Care to dance? Lady Smash? All right, Wrench Jr., Daddy's gotta go to work. You be good. Mwah. Gentlemen, shall we begin? You have the broker bridge. The system requires two users. The pilot who uses the broker bridge and the subject who is connected to the reader. This will allow you to interface with Aiden's mind. It will scan his brain and create a visual projection that you can engage with. And that's how I'll be able to revive him? Well, the hope is that you'll be able to communicate with him and perhaps identify or repair any damage. How long does this usually take? I'm eager to find out. What, wait, wait, what? You, you mean you've never done this before? This is the first human trial. The most exciting phase of a project. God damn it, you fucking lied to us! You never cared about taking Rampart out of your labs. You just want us here to be your fucking guinea pigs. Semantics. Jackson, this is insane. Okay? There is no guarantee this is going to wake up Aiden. I, I, I say we, we grab him, we, we get the fuck out of here, and we'll find a better way. There isn't a better way. 
I have to do it. You could wind up in a coma too, or worse. Everyone deserves a chance. Oh my God, that sounds so incredibly profound. What the fuck does that even mean? It means I'm going in. For Aiden. Aiden, honestly, I didn't think it would be this easy to find you. Let's get out of here. Get out of here? Yeah. Exit the simulation or whatever this technically is. Is that door the way out? I can't say anything else like it, so I think it's our best bet. I'm working. On what? I need to bury something. I lost a couple things in the house, my hat and my coat. I won't be ready without them. Ready for what? Can you get that for me? Aiden, you're hurt, and I'm trying to help you wake up. You want to be helpful? Go get my phone. Here's your phone. Who was calling? Uh, Mom, actually. She didn't sound happy. Yeah, I don't blame her. Are you ready to leave with me now? I still need my hat and my coat. Aiden, I don't know how else to say this, but you got hurt, and you're in a coma right now. You need to wake up. I left them somewhere in this house. Can't remember why. You have to look around. Why won't you come with me? I told you, I've got to bury something. I'm not going anywhere until that's done. If I get you those things, will you leave with me? Yeah, sure. If you say so. I've got your cap. And you're leaving with me, right now. Still need my coat. Fuck your coat. Fuck this, this literal mind game. You know what I saw in there, right? Is Lena just in there all the time? We need to get the fuck out of here, so let's go. I told you I need to finish this first. And what is this exactly? A grave? Your grave? You know, Mom and I had to find a way to live with what happened. But you've just been torturing yourself with it this whole time. I didn't come here so we could just lose you all over again. Jax. You have helped me so much more than you know. This is the way I'm leaving. And I can't do it without you. Aiden, please. I know you won't let me down. I have your coat. Thanks. I didn't want to be buried in my skibbies, you know? Just for the occasion, as it were. So that's it? You're just giving up? I was Aiden Pierce. The Fox. For a long time, I have blood on my hands, souls on my conscience that I can't ever set right. I'm tired. I'm ready to lay it all to rest. The only thing you know how to do is sacrifice yourself. But Mom doesn't need you to protect her anymore. I don't need you to protect me anymore. We just want you to be there. I've caused enough damage and hardship in my life, Jackson. This is a funeral. There's no getting around that. Yeah? So say goodbye to the Fox. Goodbye to Aiden Pierce the Vigilante. Bury that guy. But don't tell me that's all you are. Because you're my uncle too.
Aiden. Jackson. Where am I? Holy shit, you did it! <laughs> Very impressive. Some of the readings on the broker bridge were wholly unexpected. I don't know whether to punch you or kiss you on your stupid hologram mouth. Both? Jesus. How did I miss? Jackson, your participation here today has awarded you an extension on the Larson Family Scholarship for another two years. Well done. But as our business is concluded here today, gentlemen, I suggest you wrap things up and take your leave. Both. Definitely both. <laughs> <clears throat> beautiful reunion. Gosh, I'm tearing up over here. You can't tell though because of the mask. I feel like that angel from that movie. Now that I've brought Mr. Pierce and Mr. Pierce back together, I can go get my wings. Thanks for all your help, Ranch. No need to thank me. Just promise me your firstborn. And now I'm off. Wait, where are you going? I'm glad you got Aiden back. Now I've got my own thing to sell. Going after Rempart? Listen, man, I just went into the mind of a guy who had trouble letting shit go. It wasn't fun. Maybe you should just walk away from this. I really can't. Okay. Well, then we'll help you. Whatever you need to do, let's do it together. We've got you. Okay. All right. Let's do this. Holy! <laughs> No use. I can build another prototype. You have no way of stopping me. Oh, I've got one way. Yeah. Reggie? Whoa! So sure I was gonna kill you. Fuck! Would have been so much easier to. You know, I didn't start working with you for the money. I mean, sure, I thought you were a spoiled asshole with too much hair wax, by the way. But you had a dream. Remember? You told me you wanted to see humanity reach the stars. <laughs> we we're gonna do that together, man. <laughs> I lie to you, you naive fuck. Prick. I'll hunt you down. And all your little friends back in San Francisco. Sitara. Josh. Marcus. Sayonara. Dick. <laughs> 